hello and welcome back to my channel today we want to talk about how to create a newsletter on your WordPress website Welcome back. Now, how to create a newsletter on your WordPress website? It's very simple. There's a lot of tools to make that happen. You can actually go and actually create, uh, use a uh, uh, plugin to actually make that happen. It depends on what you want to do. But for you to be able to create a newsletter on your WordPress website, it's a very simple thing to do. Now, when you go to plugin, on that plugin because the more you want to add more functionalities on your website it's a plugin that you need now on your plugin you can just type newsletter then every plugin that will allow you to have a newsletter you can actually get a bunch of plugins that you can use to have a newsletter on your website so this one says email subscribers and a newsletter simple and effective email marketing so you want to use anyone here you want to use any you can actually use any now all these are also you know a lot of tools look at them there's a lot of them a lot a lot a lot of them contact uh, form they are also good you can also use drag and drop now there's a lot of them to use now the most important thing there is it depends on what you want to do now if it is just normal a contact form I will advise you use contact 7 okay this is the normal contact form that you can just use contact form 7 it's normal contact form that you can actually just use normally but all these guys allow you to drag and drop you know customize do so many things you want to do you want to create uh, any kind of form uh, pool questionnaire anything you want to do on your you can actually use any of the form but I just want to just focus on uh, newsletter okay so I do what install contact form 7 then activate it you know activate it you find out that he will come here so you see you have contact right now and he's telling you right now that uh, it's you know install and activate now you can just click on the settings section now it will bring you here this is actually the uh, normal uh, the fourth one that comes with it then you can either edit or you can do what go up and click add new so let's add our own so now this is our own this is the code that will you know show up in, in the front end where you want to put it uh, the first part here we see on this code we have your name we have your email we have the subject we also have you know uh, the your messages then you have the last button that will allow you to do what to click uh, send so that you can actually let that go so if you also want to you know add more functionality so you can actually do a place your code here but I think I'm okay with this all I don't need to do is to go straight to the top here and give it contact us Oh, sorry this time around I want to say a newsletter uh, but if it's a newsletter a newsletter allow me to actually have just uh, the name so let me see since it's newsletter we are having uh, newsletter it's the name uh, email and all that but because I don't think I need uh, subjects on the so I take subjects and I take messages out then also it's just the email that I need email I don't think I need the name uh, I don't think I need name uh, I don't think uh, I need name so I just think I'm okay with this too uh, just the email that's what I need I just need your email I don't even need your name so just your email is what I need then I'll just put newsletter Uh, so I said join our newsletter all right 
So I just need the email. I don't need his first name. I don't. Uh, I, don't I don't need his uh, subject. No, 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 I don't need that. But if you also want to create a different thing, that's where you need to do all that. But this is just. Uh, I just need his email so that he can actually, you know, get notify each time I post anything. So I click on the mail section. So this is already my email. Then blogging with others, Michael, blah blah blah. That's actually all that. So I can just click save, and I will need to do what publishing. Okay. So publish. So I already have that. So this is what I want. Now the form here, I could just do what copy this form. Then I will now go to where appearance, go to widget. Because so I actually want it to be by the sidebar of my website. So all I need to do is to get tests. Click tests. Yeah, I want it to be on my sidebar. Then I go to the sidebar. Then click on the text section. Then paste this code here. So give it a title. All right. So that's the title. Join this. So more of like you know encouraging them uh, to also want to join. So once you do that, you click save. Then you need to go to front of your site. So let's see what we have there. So by the side of. Uh, let me click on this particular post. All right. So this is join 4,000 members. Then so enter your email address. So you can say Ados Michael at gmail.com. Right. Then click send. So thank you for your message. It has been sent. So now they've already received your message. So they've become you know part of the members who are now going to be you know enjoying first hand you know the moment we post anything from our website, it will automatically go to that part. So this is our contact form. This is actually the one for newsletter.